Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, back here in this new cigar room. Gonna smoke my second cigar here in the room. And it is gonna be one of Caffey's new naturals uh, that are, these are now produced out of the La Aurora, La Aurora factory in the uh, Dominican Republic. Looking forward to this because I, I love all his old blends, but now he's saying that these blends are even even better, and I believe him. I definitely trust what Mr. Uh, Caffey has to say about cigars. Cold draw is amazing. Anyways, what are we what are we here for tonight? We are here because it is now the beginning of March. I have completed my uh, month of February smoking cigars. Kept track of them. I've got uh, got the list right here. And I smoked a total of 52 cigars. Only one day, which was Sunday the 26th, is the only day I did not smoke a single Lancero. It was Sunday, I was out over at uh, lounges in my son's house and didn't bring a cigar with me, got late. Not gonna stay up just to smoke a, you know, a Lancero. So one day I didn't smoke a Lancero. But other than that, smoked some great cigars. Um, my top pick for the top five that I had out of these cigars is definitely going to be the McAuliffe Lancero. This was uh, the one that had the pink label on it. And um, that one had, was really good and I know a lot of other people really tout about that, that cigar. The other one would be the La Gloria Cubana Medio Tempo. That one was really good. Not a Lancero, but it was one that I smoked. So there's, uh, there's two. Number three, these are in no particular order. I'm just going down my list and remembering which ones were which, was the Osak Lancero. Fantastic cigar. Um, that was number three um, on the list, okay? The, the fourth one is, I mean, I don't think we can get these anymore, but it's the uh, Rojas Guayaquil. Um, it, you know, those were the ones that he produced when he first, first started out. And um, number five is definitely, I mean, it's tough. I smoked a lot of good cigars, so try to figure in these out. Uh, I've got to, I've got to go with um, definitely the Espinosa Warhead Seven. That one was a Lancero. For me, it was a Lancero. It's a bit, you know, it was box press, but still, um, great cigars. Guys, check out the list. Um, I'm gonna light this baby up, this Caffey Natural, and uh, enjoy it here in the cigar room. And you guys, I hope you're enjoying something wherever you're at. And just always remember, enjoy the leaf, grow the culture. <laughs>